guys, it's Rain Over Water, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make advertisements on Roblox. On Roblox, there are three sizes of ads, the 728 by 90 banner, 160 by 600 skyscraper, and the 300 by 250 rectangle. You probably haven't taken much notice to ads, but they're all over the Roblox website. Take a little time before you make your ad to see what size you want to make. However, keep in mind that Roblox ads work like an auction. The more Robux you bid into your ad, the more likely it is going to be seen. All advertisements run for 24 hours, and there's only so much advertisement space to go around. Almost everything on Roblox can be advertised. You can even advertise decals, but chances are you've never seen someone advertise a decal before. To advertise something, click on the three dots in the upper right corner and click Advertise. This will lead you to the advertisement uploader and some information to help you out. If you don't see the option to advertise, it's either 1, because you can't advertise the item, or 2, you don't have permission to. Now, you need to create your ad. If you don't know how to make GFX, you'll need to hire someone to do it for you. Please do not beg GFX artists for free GFX, though. It's really annoying and they deserve to be paid. Here are some tips when making ads. Make them stand out. You're more likely to click on an ad that's funny or intriguing. Be unique. A lot of ads tend to have this cookie cutter format and we almost always skip over those. Make sure the GFX is made with quality. It doesn't have to be professional level, but it's going to be hard to compete with ads that have been made with top notch GFX artists. Don't make promises you can't keep and be especially careful with advertising Robux. This is very easy to get banned for or have your ad content deleted. Keep it simple. Don't put a college essay amount of writing in your ad because people are barely going to read the three words that most people put in their ads. Now, once you've made your ad and it's been approved by moderation, you can run it by going into Create and User Ads. If it's a group ad and you don't see it in the user ads, make sure you're in the Group Creations tab. Find the ad you want to run and click the gray Not Running button. Then you can bid your Robux and run the ad. Once you've run your ad, you'll notice all these weird words and numbers. Impressions are the number of times people have seen your ad in the 24 hours you've ran it. Below it is the total number of impressions. This number will only be affected if you've ran your ad more than once. Clicks is pretty self-explanatory, but it is the number of times people have clicked your ad in the time it's been run. And below it, like before, only is different when you've ran the ad more than once. CTR is the click-through rate. It's basically the percentage of people that have clicked on your ad. A good CPR is 2%, and oddly enough, I've only managed to get that percentage on my first ever ad. And finally, the bid is the amount of Robux you've placed on your ad. I hope this tutorial was helpful to you. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments, and I'll get to them as quickly as I can. If you liked this video, make sure to leave a like to help me out, and so that more people can see this video. Thank you guys so much for watching! Bye!